comes from God. God can be trusted. We can ask God for the right words, and this week, we can ask God questions. Say what? We can ask God questions. To help us understand, let's check out our lesson from Nehemiah 2, 1 through 20. What's your favorite thing to draw? I like to draw pizza, and puppies, and my family. But I have a really big family, so they're kind of hard to draw. Have you ever made something that was really hard to make? Well, in today's story, we'll meet a guy named Nehemiah who wanted to make something that was really hard to make. It wasn't a drawing, but let me tell you what it was. Nehemiah was from a city called Jerusalem, but he lived far away. When our story begins, Nehemiah was sad. He'd just heard from his brother that his hometown was in trouble. The people in Jerusalem didn't follow God like they used to, and the walls surrounding their city were falling down. This was hard news for Nehemiah to hear. He trusted God, but he didn't understand why the city he loved was crumbling like that. So Nehemiah went to the king he worked for and asked for permission to go home and lead his people in rebuilding Jerusalem. The king said, go! and even gave Nehemiah help in making the long journey ahead of him. Rebuilding the walls was a big job. In fact, even though Nehemiah knew God wanted him to lead his people, he wasn't sure how to get it done. But Nehemiah trusted God. He said, okay God, if this is going to happen, you'll have to tell me what to do next. And guess what? God heard Nehemiah's prayers and showed him what to do. Even when people doubted if Nehemiah knew what he was doing, he knew God was right there, helping him every time he had a question. Just like Nehemiah went to God when he wasn't sure what to do, we can ask God our questions too. And now we have some questions for you. Since we are talking about questions, we are going to answer these questions in the form of a question. Like Jeopardy! Let's practice. The king who asked God for wisdom. Who's Solomon? Okay, you got it. Let's play. What Solomon had brought into the temple he was building. What two women were arguing about in front of this in front of Solomon? If any of you lacks wisdom, you should ask God and it will be given to you. James 1, 5.